Hello everyone, welcome to the new episode of Akash Knowledge Nuggets. I am your host Kapil. In continuation of our SAT analysis, we will be discussing about chemistry. In order to educate us on the same, we are having a special guest from Akash Education Services Limited who is working as a chemistry faculty over there, Ms. Nidhi Panwar. Madam, welcome on the show. It's a privilege to have you over here. Thank you, Kapil sir, for inviting me on the show. Madam, uh, as we can see, NTSC stage 2 has around 100 questions. Right. Stage 2, 100 questions, SAT paper is divided into 5 subjects. Very true. And physics and chemistry hold the least number of questions. Right, 13 questions. Are 13 right. questions. Yeah, yeah. But every subject holds their importance. True. And said that the ocean is incomplete without drops of water. Right. Madam, the first question we would like to understand is, how chemistry NTSC stage 2 paper is different from stage 1? See, as you have already uh, specified the importance of chemistry by quoting the wonderful lines. Uh, I just want to tell my students that chemistry is also important and there is a difference between stage 1 and stage 2. So ma'am, if you can just elaborate that, if you can just make people aware, like what is the difference between stage 1 and uh, stage 2? Yeah, yeah. If I talk about stage 1 uh, question paper, that includes a question which are based on the straight concept. But if I talk about the stage 2 exam, there are the questions which are based on multiple concepts. So what are these like multiple concepts? Uh, see, suppose I talk about a one question. That includes two or more concepts. Okay. If suppose one question is there from the structure of atom and that can also include some part from the mole concept. So okay. two concepts are must. It means this question becomes the hybrid question. So madam, how do you see the difficulty level of stage 2 versus stage 1? Uh, as far as the difficulty level is concerned, I can say that in stage 2 exam, more twisted questions are there. Okay. It means in stage 1, in some of the states, straight questions were asked. Mm -hmm. In different states, uh, some twisted questions were also there. But definitely in stage 2 exam, no direct question is there. And even if I talk about difficulty level, that is from moderate to difficult level. So that means stage 2, the questions are from moderate to difficult, am I right? Right, very true. Madam, as per the analysis, which chapters students should focus on so that they can score maximum marks in chemistry? So uh, to identify the important chapter, we have to look at the analysis of the previous year papers. Very right, very true ma'am. Yeah, so uh, if I analyze the previous five year question papers, mm -hmm. I'll just suggest students to focus more on their class 10th chemistry. Because class 7 10th. to 8 questions are asked from class 10th chemistry only. And uh, if I talk about class 9th, there are 3 to 5 questions. And specifically, if I just want to suggest the student, I suggest them to focus on mole concept. The okay. chapter is atoms and molecules. Along with that, they should also focus on structure of atom. After that, some extended topics are also there. They are generally uh, taught in 11th and 12th standard. But these are the extended version of 9th and 10th. Okay. Okay. Uh, these are the topics like stoichiometry the part of uh, chemical reaction and equation. Okay. Uh, further, if I talk about the next thing, states of matter. This is the extended part of matter in our surrounding or uh, is matter around us pure from the ninth standard. Okay, okay. It means just focus first on the ninth and 10th standard. That's my suggestion. That means very important your suggestion says focus more on ninth and 10th. Any specific tips you would like to give to the young aspirants who are preparing for NTSC stage two, especially yeah. for chemistry? Definitely. Uh, as I've already told you, Questions based on multiple concepts are asked, like hybrid questions are there and they are just going to increase the difficulty level. So mm -hmm. I would suggest the student just to focus on the concept, they just have to practice more and more questions. And from where these questions you can get? From previous year question papers as well as from mock test papers. Just practice them, bound to the time management, be patient, be hopeful, you will definitely do good in NTSC stage 2 exam. Thank you so much madam for giving such a valuable insights. I hope by your suggestions, by your advice, students will really score good in the chemistry. Thank you so much Kapil sir and students all the best for your NTSC stage 2 exam. Here we end our series on how to excel in NTSC stage 2 with flying colors. I hope the advice, tips, strategies shared by esteemed faculties of Akash Education Services Limited will really benefit out all the students who are preparing for NTSC stage 2. We, on behalf of Akash family, we wish you all best of luck, do good, stay blessed. Thank you.